it's the angry Canuck. Because I'm a Canuck who's angry, damn it. And uh, I just want to say I'm in the his, uh, what's up. I wasn't planning on making a video today. Today's Saturday, you know. Um, I'm just relaxing today, like everybody else on YouTube is. Thank God for the Leaf Dude making all these videos today. It kept me nice and entertained this afternoon. You know it's all good. You know it's all good. <laughs> so, um, anyhow, this whole thing started with Just Allen. You know, I did make comments towards Just Allen. And yes, this whole thing started through um, Mike Skihan. And Mike Skihan said on his video, he said in his video that, you know, he mentioned Just Allen. Just to keep them alive. It's the eye of the tiger, it's the thrill of the fight. Rising up to the challenge of a rival. And the last known survivor stalks his prey in the night. And he's watching the soul of the eye of the tiger. The only really way, the only real way for those who don't understand what auto refresh is, basically it's something that can refresh a page over and over and they're pretty clever and they can try master IP addresses depending on what server they're from, that sort of thing, right? So anyways, uh, this auto refresh will, if you see a disproportionate amount of views compared to the actual ratings, because ratings are not exploitable. That's where if you rate something five stars because of your browser session and other things that make that hard to actually do. But the views are something else, you know what I mean? So. Basically, there should be about a 5 to 15%. For those who don't know, there should be about a 5 to 15% um, ratio of views. So basically, if you have 200 views, a good amount of ratings on your video, like the 5 star, should be about 20. 10% of 200 is 20. So it should be about 5 to 15%. Now, you know, if you want to see if somebody's used auto-refreshing or has cheated, basically they call it cheating and stuff, but... If you want to see if they've done that, then just go to their channel, look for videos. If they have, you know, 6,000, you know, you go to Lisa Simpson's channel, for instance, and look at some of her videos, 6,000 views and then 20 ratings. You know, that's just not normal. That's just, there's always a consistent 5 to 15%, you know, variance within ratings. So just so, just so you guys know, just so you guys know, that's how the, that's how it works. And, um, and that's pretty much it. You know, it's a fact. You're going to get between that 5 to 15, sometimes 20, sometimes a little bit less, sometimes. But it's not, you know, 10,000 views and only 80 ratings. I'm sorry, that just, it's not possible. You're auto-refreshing if that's the case. So if you look at Just Allen's videos, you know, Mike Skihan was right. And I didn't think anything of it at the time. At the time, Mike Skihan was there and I said, you know, Just Allen, blah, blah, blah. He called it out and I went over to Just Allen's videos and I looked at them and looked at his older videos. And sure enough, yeah, he was definitely auto-refreshing, like for sure. So I'm just like, okay, whatever. That's, that's, you know, what's our, lots of YouTube partners have done that. Lots of them have. Um, one of the big ones is, God, uh, what was her name there? That Ryan girl, that Ryan. Um, little Loka, you know, that Ryan character. She did all her stuff, auto-refreshed everywhere, cheated a lot. So, I mean, I think even Lisa Nova too. So, I mean, it's nothing big, right? It doesn't surprise me, but... You know, then you want to sit there and you want to talk about the, well, the community, this and the partner program. What are you talking about? You cheated your way into the partner program. That's how you got in there. This will actually, you know what they do? If you actually apply for the partnership program, they'll give you a response saying that you don't have enough views or enough traffic on your channel to, to get into the partner program. Which, that's funny because look at Follow My Distro. He got on the partner program. He didn't get any views. There's so many examples of people that got onto the partner program who didn't have any views. So, I mean, it's not about like whether you're, you know, challenged. but so what they did, but views do help. It helps in your favor. Of course, unless you're black though, you know, because those black guys, man, they, these black YouTubers, I'm telling you, they have like 1,000, 2,000 subs. They have, they can get like lots of views, legitimate views on their videos and they're not becoming partners. So, I mean, anyways, that's another, that's another topic. Anyhow, but anyhow, so anyways, just Allen, whatever, he becomes like a partner. Okay, well, whatever. But then he wants to pipe up and start talking about the community. I'm just like, well, wait a minute here. Don't try to pipe up and talk about the community and represent the community when you yourself got into the community through through cheating and, and refreshing your videos, you know? So, I mean, it, it's like, don't don't try and 
say that you know what i mean like there's lots of spamming and cheating and comments and stuff like that that go on and i'm not too much into the youtube stuff but i mean don't don't sit there and whatever and and you know try and speak up for the community it's like well you know what if if i see you basically trying to speak for the community or like you're some higher being or because you're a partner no hell no 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 like wait a minute you cheated your way into the community so i'm just going to call you out and let everybody know that you cheated because you did so that's it and so anyways leaf dude then responds and he starts saying that that oh just allen is his friend and whatever and he supports just i'm not saying the guy did anything bad i'm sure he's a nice guy i'm sure he's i'm not saying he did anything bad i'm not saying he's a bad person you know what i mean i'm not saying he's, he's that all i did was call him out on his auto refreshing that's all i did you know is that so bad you know I just want, you know, if he if he auto refresh and he has to suffer the consequences of that and it worked in his benefit, sure. Auto refreshing worked in his benefit, great. He's now a partner, of course. But I you know, if you do auto refresh and you do break the rules and you do something that isn't, you know, is against the rules, then you have to suffer the consequences of being called out on it. And all he did was just call him out on it. Like sorry, you know, like, you know, I don't think he's a bad person. And then Leaf Dude has to sit there and well, you know, he's a great guy. He's this, he's that. And so I'm not saying he's bad just because, you know, it's just YouTube. You know, just because he, he, he auto refreshes videos or whatever doesn't mean he's a bad guy. You know, I mean, uh, I don't have a problem with him or anything or a Gypsy K or anybody else or follow him on distro for that matter. I was there. I went on Gypsy K's chat room in Stickham once and uh, all they were there doing when I first got in, you know, I got in and, and I was, when I first got in, I mean, I was first there. What were they doing? Follow them on distro and these people. They were looking at people. They were getting their friends, like people who who they wanted to get on the top most discuss list. And they were all sitting there, you know, together, like all in unison, basically going to people's channels and spamming, you know, comments and stuff. And I'm sure they're not the only ones to do it. I mean, lots of other people do it, whatever. But I mean, it's just, you know, that's what people do. It's not so much that, you know what I mean, that I have an issue with, you know, if they want to spend their nights doing that, then that's fine. And going and, and, you know, going on these people's channels and basically spamming comments, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. If they want to do that, then that's fine. But I mean, it's you know, it's not that I don't like the people, but I mean, there's certain rules to become partners, and if you break those rules, you should just be called out on it. That's all. You should just you know suffer that humiliation because you know if you take it that seriously, then that's fine. I don't, but I mean, it's it's yeah. You know what I mean? You broke the rules. You auto refreshed. You really didn't have that many that amount of people watching your older videos and that's it and they've recently busted down on the auto refreshing and now you're seeing stevie ryan with that's her name stevie ryan you know now you're seeing her with uh 1000 views and and that's more realistic to what she was actually getting so as i said if you want to see how many views people are really getting look for that five to fifteen percent on the actual ratings